You mentioned a market that firefighters have been out on this scene monitoring for hot spots, and they're busy right now. You're not able to see them up there, but just moments ago, we had some smoke that was beginning to pour out. So firefighters, once again, on the roof of this historic building, making sure the flames that we saw overnight don't come back because crews, they had their work cut out for them overnight. Let's show you some cell phone video 7 News obtained that shows just what it looked like late last night as those flames were pouring out of this building here on Stewart Street, which is just on the edge of the city's Chinatown and theater districts. This building, the Jacob Worth Beer Hall, which had been here since the 1860s, was under construction, and now it has been significantly damaged. These crews were busy overnight. They used deck guns and ladder pipes, even a nearby parking deck, to try to put out this fire from all sides and salvage what they can of this historic building. One eyewitness described what they saw when they came outside. It was going up. It was like 30, 40 feet in the air. I thought it was going to hit both sides of the building, left and right. At least it didn't happen on the weekend with thousands of people on the street, nightclubs open. It would have just been 10 times worse. And no one was injured despite the size and strength of this fire. As we go back to these live pictures, you'll see that there's an apartment complex around the sides of this building. Those people actually had to be evacuated as well because of this fire. And fire department estimates that about $3 million in damage was caused by those flames. Firefighters still working to make sure those flames don't return this morning. Live here in Boston, Stephen Quinn, 7 News, today in New England.